Nintendo presents, hey guys, PK here, I guess I'll call myself that for these videos, but more Fire Emblem 7, could call this a let's play of sorts. Jumping right back into the game here. Hector and friends depart for whatever it is they're doing right now. Chapter 13, In Search of Truth. Evil music. No, I'm not quite sure if we saw these guys yet. I might have skipped a cutscene by accident. You said you were just going to frighten Elliewood. You almost killed him. Well, almost killing him would definitely frighten him. Well, I'm tired of you. Remove yourself. Some shady shit going on right here. Get shanked! There's the castle, Hollywood. <laughs> it's not no stripling. Keep your name. Why should I care what a corpse is called? Gee, Hector, he hasn't even done anything bad yet and you wanna kill him? Good thing he is actually evil. Hey you, yeah the new dog. Wing you. Of course smart thing to do would not get involved with this ugly bunch. Gotta have gold if I wanna eat. Guy's just like monologuing to himself right now. Matthew. If it hadn't been for him, I would have starved to death. Shut the hell up and get over here. He hanged the giant recruit me sign over his head. And this is basically telling you more, like, use Matthew, recruit, gee, guy. Both are correct. No doubt brilliant orders. My node brown. the No doubt brilliant orders to reset. Because for whatever reason, watching cutscenes messes up my strategy completely. Sorry if this gets annoying, but I'd rather have solid strategies than guesswork, I guess. Anyways, usually you'd send Marcus to the top left if you want to get a low turn count, but I don't like doing that. Because the bottom right is really hard to manage without Marcus, so I'll be sending him down there. And this chapter is really like my most hated along with the next one because they're just really hard. Well, not hard, but require more creative thinking than I'd like to do. Yeah. Especially because Marcus is your only really combat ready unit. Anyways, for turn one and turn one, whatever. Now, recording this, or test running this, Rebecca will miss an 87, and Oswin will miss a 72. So Hector will get rid of one random number. So Rebecca can hit. And Oswin can hit. Now Bartra can continue on this way. Actually, yeah, I should equip that because the Pegasus is gonna wanna take it. I'm gonna take that javelin too. Hmm. Yeah. We're fine. Trades up to Dorcas. We'll be fine. Now, hopefully, Hector hits this dude. Hopefully Hector hits this dude. Yeah! You want to kill this Pegasus. And we've pretty much gotten past the hard power of the chapter by getting rid of the initial rush of enemies in the bottom right. Turn 2. 
advancing like normal. Ooh, Matthew missed. Well, whatever. Not like I planned anything past those two turns. This guy is in position to destroy this village, and I want to get what's in this village. His goals don't coincide with my goals, so he's gonna die. Kaboom! Magic explosive. We get a mine. I'm gonna glitch the hell out of later chapters with that. Rebecca, please hit. Yes. I think I should trade the javelin back. To Lowen, but whatever. How far can Lowen move? Not far enough to be important. We don't need the javelin quite yet. Not quite yet. And D's range. Can't stop calling him Gee. Whatever, both are correct. Hmm. Bartra will hand X this guy. Gotta save that village. Not particularly the item that we get from the village, but who's in the village we want to save. Marcus draws a lot of shit just by being there. Nothing's gonna harm him. Bartra gets a level up, it's gonna be terrible. He got speed, and defense, and res. He proved me wrong. What I like to do is... Hey Merlinus, this will never do, look at the time. I must leave for now. I mean, now, time is money after all. Hurry, hurry, rush, rush, rush. Mm, what's this? That man must have dropped it. It's a torch. These are of questionable usefulness. I guess. Now, for this area, I really just like to take a step back. Pretty sure a Pegasi rider, Pegasus riders, spawn down there. I do want to deliver the javelin while staying out of range. So I will do that. And if I put Marcus in that range, can Marcus reliably kill this guy? No. So I'll draw him in a bit closer with Lowen. Seems good enough. Yeah, those brigands move. Pretty sure the other guys don't move as long as you don't aggravate them. Hmm. Please don't hit get hit. Perfect. Pretty sure this guy has a hand axe too. Hmm. Let Lowen do it. Oh boy. We're gonna let Marcus get all the shit from this side. Just by being on that fort. He's gonna solo that area. And many people would not like my method of giving him all the EXP, but it's really one of the most manageable ways to go about doing this. Sarah gets more EXP. Let's see how this turn goes. Ah, Gi moved up. Damn, you got raped. As long as Marcus clears out most of this area, I should be able to let Matthew walk in and get Gi. Just fine. Ah, the archers. That's why I brought the javelin over. So Marcus will draw the... Or rather, aggro the... Archers and see now we have perfectly empty bottom area.
now then. Oof. I end up attacking G Gee, Guy, whatever. Need to decide on a name for him. I usually end up stealing or attacking from him because I think talk is by default at the top like it is in other games, but it's not. Anyway, Guy is like, I'ma cut you! You can't beat me, Matthew. And he's like, hold on, I think I'd re prefer it if you repaid what you owe me. Huh? I gave you food. If I remember correctly, you said you owed me your life. I only said that because you said you'd feed me if you did. I mean, I did. I hadn't eaten in ten days, damn, guy. This isn't fair. The people of Sake never lie. Hmm. I finally find work and now I have to throw it away. This is all your fault. And I think we've got this chapter in the bag now. This is Guy. And he's our first example of hard mode bonuses. He usually has like, I think it's 6 or 7 strength and 11 speed. So he got a pretty hefty boost. I don't like him that much because of this. He's not a very good swordsman, and you pretty much have to use someone else that takes Guy's place. So he doesn't have much of merit, and we'll let him attack this dude. Can this soldier attack? He can. I would not like it if he attacked. Gotta get rid of one of those guys. Mm -hmm. 13 and 13. Matthew has 4 defense. 9 and 9. He's fine. I rhymed. Like I said, we're pretty much in the home clear, home stretch for this chapter now. And with that, my commentary is going to become very boring. should probably deliver those hand axes to who they're meant for. Oh boy, forgot about those cavaliers over there. I will be letting Marcus kill them all. I don't like risking anyone else. Can Matt, um, Ellie would steal a kill? Mm, that's a no. Oh yeah. Oil Logan. Give me that axe. I don't want him drawing in the Pegasus just yet. And Bartra and Oswin struggle to catch up. At the most, Bartra will just be another heal for Sarah. And Rebecca has outlived her usefulness. Actually, not yet. I don't think. Hey. What up with the not killing him? Plus HP. That's nice. Oh no, more reinforcements. I'd like to draw them back. Gonna make a box around Sarah. Cause I'm afraid of that archer. <laughs> For no good reason. I just don't like archers. Enemy or otherwise. Probably attack alone. Hmm. I'm lucky. Ellie would be able, be able to steal a kill. Let's see how this goes. Yep. Pretty standard. I go really slow in these chapters. It's really just the way I play. 
what's this guy have? Oh, another sword. Jesus. Hey, Ellie would kill and stuff. Utility. <laughs> Damn. Marcus already put it on show. Get magic, get magic. Yeah! Beautiful level up. Nine turns. Yeah, I'm not exactly a low turn count person. Hmm. Hmm. Matt's gonna get a level up from this. Let's see. <laughs> Skill, speed, defense. Okay. This guy can't go very far. <laughs> Ooh, I don't like that guy. Don't like it at all. Hector, closer. No one else is important. Hulk. Marcus gets rid of that guy. These guys don't move until you step in their range. Probably should heal first. Slow and steady. Matt has to get closer too because he'll sell stuff. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Haha, get shit on Pegasus. Level up! What shall it be? Jesus Christ. As long as you get strength, I'm good. These guys have lances. Which means Hector could quite probably shit all over them. Partra. I hate Partra. Why do I have to use Partra? Let Marcus take one of them. I doubt the other is dumb enough to attack Marcus. Lowen gets to be delivery dude again. Wow, he is dumb enough to attack Marcus. Okay. Mm, this turn. God can't do shit to Marcus. and Matthew up there to get some stuff we'll be needing. What's this? You've made it this far? Ha 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 ha. Might as well turn on animations. At least for bosses. Oh. Sell the red gem. And this thing. Mm, buy heal. Why not? You're very limited in cash in Hector Horde mode, so... Boy, Javelin's like crazy. Oh boy. I don't want- I don't want to risk that, for whatever reason. And yeah, I don't have a merchant yet. I would like to have a merchant. So, should probably send someone up there. Hey, animations. I'm probably risking this way too much. I would like Hector to get the hill. Come on out, we're here.
What have you done? If you want to know, you'll have to best me first. Of course Hector can just give me that. Easily. I would like to buy a hand axe. Come on, Marcus, don't miss a 95. Too bad, eh, laddie? I have no qualms with giving Marcus a boss kill. How many turns is that? 15. I'm definitely not getting an S rank. Long healing animation. Back to off you go, and we seize. Lord Hellman! Is that you, Wellywood? He must apologize for his complete lack of importance to the story. If I hadn't told Elbert about Darren's plans. Elliewood has lost the ability to make sentences. Lord Hellman! Hold on! Beware the Black Fang. Lord Hellman! He's gone. It can't be. Lord Hellman. I think he said that five times already. Blast! What's going on? We go to Laos. We must speak to the Marquis. You're right. I can't sit still. ADD Hector. Who's that dude? Who are you? <laughs> Steward. First you give Lord Hellman a proper burial. Imply scene cancel have to meet. Politics, politics, politics. You must keep moving. Lord Hellman. Accept side quest. By saving the village in the top left corner, you get access to this side quest. And I will um, leave it at that.